Hello, my name is Andrew Liang. I'm from San Jose, California. In my project, I developed an AI-based field assessment system utilizing computer vision and acoustic signal processing. Last summer, I learned that bees are vital to society, as they pollinate over 80% of all plants. However, colony loss rates over the past decade have averaged at around 40% annually. This motivated me to use my machine learning knowledge to help save the bees. In my literature review, I noticed three key gaps in the field. The first was that nobody had combined visual and audio signals to identify beehive health states. I hypothesized that doing so could result in more accurate bee health prediction. Second, there was no paired data set of bee images and sounds, and there was a general lack of data in this field. Finally, nobody had built an end-to-end -end system that integrated data acquisition, bee object detection, bee health assessment, and a web application. Therefore, my objective became to develop a novel multimodal model with paired visual and audio features to create a real-world data set to advance bee research and to develop a comprehensive bee health assessment system for beekeepers to use in preventing colony collapse. To gather data, I went to 25 beehives in three local apiaries owned by Bay Area beekeepers and conducted experiments at home. I collected around 100 gigabytes of data and created four data sets with over 12,000 images and audio clips. After obtaining the data, my first step was to identify the presence of bees. Next, I created a multimodal neural network by combining features from both visual and audio health assessment models, resulting in a more accurate approach to evaluating bee health. In my project, I had three key learnings. The first was that visual and audio signals could complement each other. This is demonstrated by the superior performance of my multimodal model compared to either individual model. This validates my hypothesis. Second, I found that bee sounds are usually a more reliable indicator of bee health than images. This could be because bees make distinct sounds under different conditions, and even if they have behavioral changes, this is not able to be captured well by images. Finally, I discovered that the sequential patterns in the audio signals may not have been informative in this work for predicting bee health, since the long short-term memory model was not as strong as expected in the study. Although I have collected real-world data and trained models, the end purpose of this research is to develop a bee health assessment system which beekeepers can use to preserve their colonies. To advance bee research, I have shared some data sets to the public and have received positive comments from them. Additionally, I have already created a near real-time live streaming system where I collect data using a Raspberry Pi with a camera and a microphone. I am in the process of talking to beekeepers and local bee guilds who have expressed interest in my research to better tailor this system to their needs. b -Well provides two key benefits to beekeepers. First, they can monitor their hives remotely from a centralized location, making hive checkups more convenient. Beekeepers can also use the health assessment provided in the system to take early actions to address specific issues in hives. This allows beekeepers to manage hive health much more efficiently. With BeeWell, beekeepers can protect their colonies, ultimately contributing to a more healthy and sustainable environment. Thank you for listening.